And we here at News 5 also want to help out. If you are a small business owner across southern Colorado or Colorado Springs, just listen up because you may be eligible for an immediate loan of up to $25,000. But you do have to act quickly. News 5's Jessica Bretto explains. If you're a small business located in the zip code 80910, 80916, or 80903, you have until midnight Thursday to apply for this loan recovery program called Survive and Thrive. It's targeting businesses in Southeast Colorado Springs, which may be smaller than those in other parts of the community. You can apply online through a site called Exponential Impact. You'll just fill out an application with basic information about your business, how COVID-19 has impacted operations, and you'll need to attach three documents, your 2019 profit and loss sheet, balance sheet, and a letter of recommendation. One of the folks behind this program also owns Good Neighbors Meeting House in Colorado Springs and knows firsthand how vital these businesses are to our city. Small businesses provide jobs. Small businesses are the ones that provide spaces for people to go out to eat, to have a great time. They make up a quality of life. And that includes those in the southeast side of town that may not realize this help is out there. We really care about southeast businesses. We don't want them to be left behind. There's been so much work around southeast revitalization and we want to save as many southeast businesses as we can. On Exponential Impact's website, you can also apply to get matched up with a business mentor. Now, this deadline to apply for a loan has been extended specifically for Southeast businesses to give them a chance to apply if they haven't already. Business owners, you can get up to $25,000, and for the first year, no payment is required and the interest rate is zero. Remember, the deadline to apply is Thursday at midnight. We have all the information and links you need on our website at KOAA.com. Always watching out for you. Southern Colorado, Jessica Barreto, News 5.